G'day guys, it's Matt here. Um, I just want to talk about something that's been on my chest for a long time and it's a personal relationship that I have lost and I am trying to regain. Um, you see, I am a Christian and I believe in the Lord Jesus Christ. Um, but I've been having problems in the last couple of years and I've slipped away and that's not good. My mental health, my physical health has pushed me away from him and I need to try and, re uh, uh, try and rebuild my relationship with God. It's been a hard journey. Ever since I was born, I've been in and out of hospital, um, uh, been having a lot of difficulties at school, and, you know, just in the recent couple of years, I've lost my way. I've slipped away from the church, and he used to give me the strength and the will to help me through anything, but because I've slipped, I've sinned and and that's not good. I am um, been struggling and mental health is a big part of it. You know, when you've got depression, anxiety, autism, it doesn't help. And when you've got medical issues and a rare birth defect to try and look after, you know, it's hard hard when you lose focus you know because of my birth defect I've got a lot of urinary issues and you know I know that's a bad excuse for me not going back to where I was but because I've got this constantly having urinary infections and all that puts me down so much it's hard and then when you've got mental issues, try and look after your mental health, that's so difficult. But I know the love of Jesus Christ, it makes things easier. But when you slip away and you know you've slipped away, it's hard and it's sad. But I have tried so, so much in the recent couple of weeks, but I've just lost everything. Um, I know that there is hope. I know he's a forgiver of sin. I know he can wipe away the slate and start afresh. And I know, I believe that he still exists, which is great. Um, I'll continue singing his praises. I've got a lot of musical content on my channel already that um, that I sing Christian stuff on top of regular stuff. I make vlogs. I make mental health vlogs. I make my birth defect vlogs. Um, yeah. If any of you want to know what my birth defect is, I've got it in my description. I have videos on it. And having urinary problems is a tough one. Um, constantly sometimes wetting yourself and wetting the bed, wetting yourself, smelling like urine. It's not hard. It's hard sometimes, but God gave me this because he knew I could cope and I could show the world his love and um, it's hard when you slip and the darkest days hang over your head and it's difficult to break away from all of that but with his grace and glory and he being there you know he can rescue you. You just got to look for, hear his voice, follow his voice, kneel at his 
feet and um, just focus on his wisdom and he will guide you back to where you need to be. It's just struggle when when life throws your curveball and you try and throw it back but it hits, hits you, you go down and when you go down it's hard to get yourself back up. It's hard to focus and I know the struggles. The struggles are real and you know it's been a hard, hard path and I know life was not meant to be easy, it was meant to be difficult, but when you have issues like urinary issues and on top of that mental health, it makes it even harder to focus on that light and I've tried so hard to try and get back onto the right path and it's been hard. I need to reach out for help and but I don't have the strength to. I feel like I'm, I've let people down and I'm a weakling and I don't want to ask because I feel like what are people going to think of me and I have issues in that department and trying to open up more is hard. So I hope that um, someone can listen to this and know that there is always light at the end of the tunnel. And if you are able to ask, ask for help. Don't be like me and let it slide. There are people out there that would be willing to help, willing to pray over you, willing to say, hey, come here and we'll guide you through life. You know, we, as Christian people, we love to help other people. And, um, yeah, I just lost my courage somehow and I need to get it back. Um, it's been a long and hard journey and I am just trying to find my way back and I just hope I can find peace again to be able to go back to all that, you know, I'll get there. I will get there. Slowly, surely. But I just need to find my church family again and say, hey, I've been struggling and can I help? Can you help? I know they're willing to help me. It's just trying to tell them that I need that help. You know, I'll get there. I will get there. It's just going to be just a little, just a little bit of a wait. Okay, guys, I'm going to get going. You guys all have a blessed and wonderful day. God bless and see you later. Until the next video. Bye bye.